Hey, what up guys, John from Mongo Fishing. So today, I'm bringing you the last Lucky Tackle Box Tournament Series of the year. This is the December 2018 LTB Tournament Series. Now, I already did this uh, unboxing earlier, um, except for I didn't push record. So, surprise. All right, so let's go through this. I'm going to set that off to the side because one of the baits isn't here. So there's an LTB calendar. Set that right there. Let's get our bait card. If you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button right down there. Follow along. Got big things coming for 2018. And unfortunately, you just missed my 10 days of giveaways where I gave away baits. Put people in the Christmas spirit every day for the first 10 days of December. Um, and we already have plans for what we're going to do for next year's 10 days of giveaway. So, uh, yeah, you definitely want to stay tuned. Hit that subscribe button. But let's get into this because this is why you guys are here. First things first is the Bait Rigs T-Boned Shad Series Crankbait. The T-Boned Shad Series Crankbait. So it looks like a jerkbait to me, but, you know, whatever. Call it whatever you want. Uh... Sticky hooks, definitely want to replace them, but they're decent size. I mean, really not much to say about it. Fire Tiger looks more like a jerkbait than a crankbait. I'll probably fish it like a jerkbait. But that's that. MSRP on this is six. Does that say six eighty nine? Seriously. MSRP is $6.89. Wow. Let's set this right here. Next up is the Booyah Baits Flex 2. So this is another crankbait. New bone color. So two to five foot square bill. Deep knock to it. Sticky hooks. Decent size. And that might be a might be a little undersized, but I mean that's it's pretty good. Uh, MSRP on that is $9.99. Wow, that's crazy. Next up is the cold blooded baits the stalker. Cold blooded baits the stalker. Another crankbait. It's got a pretty unique body design see that hooks are sharp kind of a high pitch rattle really wide bill I'm curious to see how this thing swims pretty cool iridescent paint job uh, looks like like a medium depth type of crankbait um, yeah, medium diving crankbait is all it says. So whatever medium depth is, that's what that gets down to. Gets down to the old medium. MSRP on that is $9.99 also. Next up is the Z-Man Chatterbait. We have all seen Chatterbaits before. Frog color. This is the basic, like, OG, old school freaking Chatterbait. Basic keeper on it. I mean, decent size hook, especially for something this small. It's quarter ounce, frog color. I don't think I've ever seen a quarter ounce chatterbait. I've seen the micro, but I don't think I've seen a quarter ounce like regular size. So that is that MSRP on this. Four ninety nine. Next up is the live target sunfish. Live target sunfish. So this is a soft plastic swim bait. Okay, so it's got a single hook up on top. It also has a spot right here for you to put a treble hook if you wish. That dorsal fin kind of acts as like a weed guard. Um, I mean, they're pretty simple. 
chunk it out there, reel it back. I'm not much of a bed fisherman, but if you fish this when the, bed are, when the bass are spawning, put this on their bed, kind of bounce it around or whatever, they will definitely pick this up to move it out of the way. It's a good way to catch big spawning females. Again, I'm not really much of a bed fisherman though, so that's just not my cup of tea. Uh, MSRP on this is $11.99. It's pretty heavy too. It's probably pretty close to an ounce. What's that say? Seven eighths of an ounce. Okay, next up is the Hydrotech Wave. Hydrotech Wave. It's another crankbait. It says two and a half to five feet, three and a half inches, floating. I like that lip design. That's kind of it's kind of unique. I like the paint job too. Sticky sharp hooks. Anyway, a little undersized on the hooks, but you, I mean, most of the time you want to swap out the hooks on uh, on most crankbaits anyway, so really not that big of a deal. I'll probably end up swapping them out regardless. Um, I really like that paint job. MSRP on this is $9.99. Next up is the California Classic Bait Company Golden State Grub. So a soft plastic. California Classic Golden State Grub. It is a crappie jig. Basically just a basic crappie jig. Target species, bass, saltwater, like the whole ocean, trout, crappie, and walleye. So you can take this to go catch yourself a largemouth or a smallmouth or a trap, uh, trout, crappie, or walleye, or tuna, or a whale shark, swordfish. It's a huge marlin. What'd you get it on? Got it on my California Classic Bait Company Golden State Grub. All right, uh, next up is the Big Bite Baits Shaking Squirrel. Okay, yeah, so the Big Bite Baits Shaking Squirrel is not in there. Instead, I got 5-inch Wacky Sticks from Cream Lures. So, they're stick baits. You know, they're not Senkos, because Senko is a Yamamoto bait. So this is the same thing, it is a stick bait just not a Senko. Um, watermelon Red Black Flake, probably one of the best colors out there. It's like a staple in every tackle box. That's going to catch fish, no doubt in my mind. MSRP on this is $3.99. MSRP on the California State Golden Grub is $5.99. Next up is the Doomsday Tackle Sea Shad. Doomsday Tackle Sea Shad. This thing's pretty cool looking. Baby Flash Gill, six count. Come on. Come on. All right, so it's a little swim bait. It's got some really cool Mylar strip in there, which does limit the action. Um, I'm not sure how much it's going to kick because of that, but drop shot or jig head. So, I mean, it's, I guess it's really not going to kick that much anyway. Or maybe they're not expecting you to use it in a, in a way that's going to kick that much. has that raised lip on the back of the tail, so it should provide a little bit of kick. But, I don't know, I'm curious with that Mylar strip in the middle, how much that will limit its, uh, its mobility. But they're pretty cool looking. There's six of them. MSRP is $3.99. Next up is, good God, man. Next up is the Spike It 6 inch lizard. I must have slept wrong or something. My freaking shoulder and neck are killing me. You know you're getting old when sleeping hurts. Um, yeah, so 6 inch lizard, three pack. Again, little mylar strips inside it. I don't know. There's not much to say. It's a lizard. And 
spike it with garlic scent. You can smell the garlic coming out of it, actually. So I'm not going to really get into that. MSRP on that is four bucks. Next up is the Riot Baits Streaker Swim Bait. We're going streaking! Riot Baits Streaker Swim Bait. So it is a paddle tail swim bait. Got a little compartment right there to tuck your hook in a little bit. I mean, I don't know really what all to say. It's actually pretty heavy for its size. Probably about five inches long. Pearl color, it doesn't say that, but that's what the color it looks like. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven of them in a bag. Um four and three quarter inches long, not five. And MSRP is four bucks, three ninety nine. Next up is a Strike King Rage Craw. I like these things. I like using them as jig trailers. I like using them as chatterbait trailers. I like using them by themselves. Coffee scented. It's basically the same thing as the Guggen baits. They share the same patent. That little raised lip right there is what makes them special. That's what the patent is all about. Again, put this thing as a, a jig trailer or a chatterbait trailer or anything like that. Works like a champ. So I know for a fact that these things catch fish. They catch lots of fish. So that is that. MSRP on this is $3.99. Where are they getting these for $3.99? I swear they're like five bucks everywhere I go to buy them. Huh. Anyway, that's those. Next up is the Bait Rigs Bloodline Hook. That's literally all it says. Bait Rigs Bloodline Hook. It is four tiny hooks. MSRP on that's five bucks. There is no way I would spend $5 on four just little tiny basic hooks. Okay. Uh, and the last thing is Trapper Tackle Drop Shot Hooks. If you have not seen Trapper Tackle, they're a very unique hook design. So these are six one knot. Trapper tackle hooks are very, very unique. I dig these things. They work like a champ. It's just a really unique design. It's great for drop shotting. And ironically, that's what these are, is drop shot hooks. Drop shot live bait finesse hooks. That is that, guys. So I'll put the grand total down here. Quick run through again. Looks like two things, a terminal tackle. Six, five regular soft plastics, one salt water. A swim bait, a chatter bait, four assorted crank baits, and a calendar. That is that, guys. Thank you very much for watching. If you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button it's right down there. It looks like me holding a fish. If you enjoyed the video, Give it a thumbs up and drop a comment below which bait intrigues you the most. Again, guys, thank you very much for watching. As always, get out on the water, be safe, and go stick some lips.